kusani kaya we. Kule nua china la koyesu. O chume kusani ka. Kule aburu china la ko. Mungu chume kusani ka. Kule nua china la ko. Mungu chume kusanika Kuli tukuza china lako Wana kuna liye kama wewe Hakuna liye kama wewe O shalabo sheli Limo zile boyare Iyo po zila bo shikele Iyo somi le bore baya Usi le shile Usi maro di shile ba Shoma ramine mana maya Usi baro si te keze Usa di la bo shada ba Iya rimando bo shile ba O chume kusanyika Chume kusanyika bwana Chume kusanyika yesu tulinue Shina lako Tua inua sauti zetu bwana O shalabana bayandaba Shimaro bo zangara baba ya ndere bobo ya zeke tele bo Rima shendelele bo ya zika Repo zike tele bo sha Shalamani bo ye zeke O angalia bwana Angalia yesu Angalia Yesu we Angalia, angalia Sisi wana wako Mungu chume kusanyika Sisi watu wako Wana chume kusanyika Kulinua china lako Kuli abudu china lako Tukisema wastahili Tukisema umeinuliwa Obwana tuwa kuinuwa Obwana tuwa kupasifa Mungu wetu tuwa kuabudu Mungu wetu uabudiwe Uabudiwe nasileo Uabudiwe nasileo boana Tua inu wa mikono yetu kwako Heshi mana wa mla kaniza kogwana Sote zika kurudie Hakuna liye kama wewe Mungu wa ishara O mungu wa matendo Matendo ya koni maku China la kola tenda mambo makubwana Tunasema umetukuka Tunasema umetukuka buwana Tunakili mungu zako Tunakili uwepo wako Tunakili mamlaka yako Tunakili uwezo wako bwana Tio mana heshima tunakupa yesu we Tio mana heshima 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 Tio mana yesu tuwa inuwa china lako Tio mana buwana Utukufu tuwasema uote ni wako Tio mana yawe 
O tu na shukaro bo shile kama so bilele boya Shendelele boya si kere bo bo shada Rima so poro so koti bo ye kete Ripara sadi boro si mandabu Iele mande sharobi na kusaya Rapo koze teba shele bo bo ya I worship you, Lord. I give you glory. I give you honor. I give you adoration, Lord. Oh, shandara baka sololo boya kande. Hallelujah. Oh, oh. angalia Yesu e sisi wana wako. Wana tume kusanyika Sisi wana wako Mungu tume kusanyika Toba bwana utuangalie Toba bwana utembe nasi Toba bwana nguvu zako zidilike mahala hapa Tau babuana uku wako ukaone kane mahala hapa o mungu wetu o shane amanuku ya sibo ya tayara boni iyo poko zitele bo shila bakaya robi shendelele bo ya sopo roko yeteba rima shendelele bo ya sikara bo shi Iyo pozi karama shende bozia Ayarubuku masiporo kozi taya Haleluya I worship you Lord Haleluya Sisi wana wako tume kusangika Angali ya bwana O sisi wana wako tume kusanyika angali ya bwana O sisi wana wako tume kusanyika angali ya bwana O sisi wana wako tume kusanyika kukuabudu bwana O sisi wana wako Tume kusanyika kukupa sifa bwana O sisi wana wako Tume kusanyika kukue shimu bwana O sisi wana wako Tume kusanyika angalia bwana O angalia bwana Kama we 
wewe tunakuinamia tukikili unatutosha angalia tunakuinamia tukikupa heshima zetu wewe angalia bwana angalia bwana angalia
Tusaidia Bwana Tusaidia 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 Yesu we Tusaidia Bwana Twainua mioyo yetu kwako Wewe sio kama mwanadamu wewe sio kama mwanadamu Uona siri za mioyo yetu Bwana twajitoa kwako Bwana twajitoa kwako Kama dhabihu iliyo hai Mungu Ukatende nami chinsi upendavyo Ukatende nami chinsi upendavyo Najitoa kwako Najitoa kwako Wewe ni mfariji Wewe ni tabibu Wewe ni chemedali Siwezi Bila wewe Siwezi Siwezi Yesu Siwezi Bila wewe bwana Oh siwezi Mungu wangu bila wewe wewe ndiye msaada wangu Wewe ndiwe nguvu zangu Wewe ndiwe kimbilio langu Wakati wa unyonge wangu Wakati wa unyonge wangu we Wewe ndiwe kimbilio bwana Wakati wa msaada Bwana siwezi pata kwingine kwa wanadamu ni kwa muda tu lakini kwako ni kwa kudumu wewe ndiwe sada wangu wewe ndiwe sada wangu wewe ndiwe nguvu zangu na kuinua na kuabudu Bwana na kupasifa na kushukuru na kutukuza nasema watama na kimasia oh wewe ndiwe bwana suluhisho tiwe cha wangu bwana tiwe nguvu zangu Oh watu wa yote bwana wewe ndiwe wewe ndiwe wewe ndiwe wewe ndiwe wewe ndiwe oh wewe ndiwe bwana kombe la maisha yangu bila wewe siwezi bwana oh tazama koshele boya kaze tebo Ele bobo ya si marobi kande Ze poro si karabo shinde boya Zi marobi kashoro bo soto Robi karabi ya sobile Romi nene nemo ya sandara bakushe Ipoko zila kushandili bobo ya zaya Ropa raba shinde nene bo ya zeke Ropa kashi talaba kondo bobo bosia Oshanda raba kuzo toro bobo ya seke Ni wewe tu bwana Utakaye ni elekeza Kwene zine chia sifazo Ni wewe Ni wewe Utakaye ni panguvu Ili niweze kutenda Chinsi buwana upenda vio Kuna ile nchi ya umeliwekea Naoma ni kaifu ate Vika milifu mungu wangu Mana peke yangu siwezi Mana peke yangu siwezi Adui ataniweza Oh adui 
Hataniweza bila wewe Bwana. Ndio maana nakulilia saroboshe. Ndio maana Bwana. Kwa uwezo wangu siwezi. Kwa uwezo wangu siwezi. You are the one who gives strength, Lord. To my feet, oh, shadi barize. Yoro mine kaye rebosha. Hallelujah, worship you. I need you, I need you, Lord. The more I need you, Jesus. The more I need you, the more I need you more, the more I need you, the more I keep on needing you, Jesus. I can never be sufficient of myself. I can never be sufficient, your Lord. Content and with anything else but you, Lord. You are the true joy. You are the true peace. You are the true peace that my heart desire. You are the true joy that my heart desire. Oh, redeem I worship you. I bless you. I give you praises. I give you glory. My brothers and sisters, open up your mouth. Let's continue worshiping the Lord. Let's continue giving him praises. Even as we ask of his kingdom to be established in our lives. Even as we pray for his kingdom to be established in our lives. The Bible tells me in the book of Matthew. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And everything else shall be added. And everything else shall come. And everything else shall accompany you. But seek ye first the kingdom. Seek ye first the kingdom. Oh, Sharabarobo Seketeli. Zimarobo Shakarama Yandabo Sete. Oh, Shandarabaka Sololo Boyazela. Ziporoko Sitarababaya. Matthew 6. Reading from verse 31. I would that we read together. Oh, Shalabarobo Sekete Boyakaye. Let's keep the keyboard on. Sama kasholo binda raba kata bozo korebo shanda raba. The Bible says, "Therefore, do not worry, saying, 'What shall I eat, or what shall I we drink, or what shall we wear?' For after all these things, the Gentiles seek. For your heavenly Father knows." That you need all these things. But seek first the kingdom of God. And his righteousness. And all these things. Shall be added. Unto you. My brothers and sisters. As we continue worshiping the Lord and pray. Today we are desiring that the kingdom of heaven. May be established in our lives. The kingdom of heaven. We will be established in our families. The kingdom of heaven we will be established in our county. The kingdom of heaven we will be established in our nation. That is our prayer today. And my heart desire is for the kingdom of the Lord to be established. There are things that the Lord is asking of us. And he has given us priority. And the Lord wants us to seek first his kingdom. The Lord is asking us to seek first his kingdom. And his righteousness. And everything else. Everything else. Everything else. Name it. That pertains to the kingdom. Will be added unto us. When we talk about seeking the kingdom. There is no kingdom without the king. The Bible is simply telling us to seek 
our fellowship with the king to go for our relationship with the king to seek for an intimacy with the king because if you got the heart of the king everything else that is in the kingdom shall be added unto you it will not be difficult to embrace to inherit to achieve to acquire anything else that is in the kingdom if you gonna get a good relationship with the king so I would before we start proclaiming and asking for things because we are getting there I want us to establish a relationship with our master I know you have one but I want you to open up your mouth and tell the Lord I want to know you more I want you to open up your spirit and tell the Lord I want to love you more I want you to open up your mouth and tell the Lord forgive me where I prioritized otherwise where I prioritized otherwise where I prioritized my job where I prioritized my family where I prioritized my businesses instead of giving priority to the kingdom my father I'm here for a new establishment somebody open up your mouth tell him you are here for a new establishment open up your mouth tell him you want to set things in order you want to set things in order Lord, you want to set things in order help us that we be able to prioritize well Oh, help us, Lord. Oh, help us, Lord. Oh, Redeemer, help me. To put my priorities well, dear Master. Oh, that I'll be able to number my days. That I'll be able to number my days, Lord. That I'll be able to walk in your wisdom. My andoborasata kushadi le boyaka. Ropi le masoko robo shandara bindebo. Ia posi ketele bo shakara mayande bose. Rapo ko shandi la bakande robo boyande bose. Oh, there is more to Christianity. Than just salvation, somebody. There is more to Christianity than just salvation. There is the kingdom, the kingdom business, the kingdom priorities. Open up your mouth, tell the Lord, I want to establish order in my life. I want to establish order in my life. Oh shakara mazo poko zeke te bo shandara bindo robo zeke rapo shadile bo wana ni saidiye oh mumbo wangu ni saidiye ni saidiye bo wana ni saidiye bo wana where I focused on the wrong things Lord help me where I have focused on the wrong things, Lord, that pertains to my life. Your word is clear, Lord, that I should not be worried of my personal life, that I should not be worried of what I will eat or what I will drink, Lord, like the Gentiles do, like them that who have not believed to Jesus. Oh, Father, for you know that I need. For you know that I need. You know my needs, Lord. You know my needs, Lord. Help my heart. Help my heart, Lord. Hallelujah. Help my heart, Jesus. Help my heart. Help my heart, Lord. Oh God, that I'll be able, that I'll be able 
father to follow your commands oh God pertaining my life I want to know more of your kingdom I want to know more of your kingdom I want to know more about healing I want to know more about singing I want to know more about King of all glory service to you I want to know more dear father I want to know more about your kingdom about your kingdom dear Lord I want to know more about you Lord I want to understand you more I want to understand your word more I want to understand the scriptures more I want to understand King of all glory divinity more my father I want to know more about the heavenly for if that knowing there is everything else for in that knowing there is everything else that I need I worship you oh I give you praise that somebody open up your mouth somebody continue pleading with the father somebody continue pleading with the father open up your mouth tell him to teach you to show you what you need to do tell him to show you how are you gonna do it tell him to show you for your heart desires to seek him to love him to serve him tell him to show you how seeking the kingdom means seeking the ruler and the one who reigns upon that kingdom seeking the glory of the father seeking the power of the father for in the kingdom there is glory in the kingdom there is victory in the kingdom there is power in the kingdom there is excellence in the kingdom there is peace in the kingdom there is joy in the kingdom there is establishment in the kingdom there is fulfillment in the kingdom in the kingdom there is all that our hearts have been seeking for we thank you we worship you we bless you we give you praises to your father oh we give you glory we adore you we honor you we celebrate you hallelujah shende boroko sima rabakande boya shatala bindobo oh shakara mindobo kosi telibaraza tala bindobo bikama soba Ramano mano koya si boro kita la bindo baya sele boyo kopo so tara bindo bo o shanda rabaka so toro bobo shike the one of the Lord says in the book of Romans reading from chapter 14 at verse 17 Romans chapter 14 at verse 17 the Bible says for the kingdom of God is not eating and drinking but righteousness at peace and joy in the Holy Ghost when the word of the Lord talks about eating and drinking it talks about the things that are of the world the desires that are our bondage desire the things that we are running after each and every day for the fulfillment of our lives the things that we are seeking, the ugly things that we are learning after so that we can live the life that we presume it is the life that God has ordained of us. But the word of the Lord is telling us the kingdom of God is all about righteousness. And from the prior text that we have read, the one who was telling us we seek for the kingdom and righteousness and peace and joy in the Holy Ghost I want us now to engage in the righteousness of God 
How do you seek the righteousness of God? The word tells me that he who knew no sin died for my sin. He carried my sin that I may become a partaker of the righteousness of God. Blessed be the name of Jesus Christ. There is no cost that I'm going to pay to receive righteousness because righteousness I have received as a gift from the Lord. My brothers and sisters, we have received the gift of righteousness from the Lord. But the Lord is still urging us to seek more of it. We have the gift, but we need to grow it. Blessed be the name of Jesus Christ. The righteousness of God is in our lives. It has been given us. But I want you to take a few minutes now and check your life. Check your life. Check your life. Get to see. You know, righteousness is that which gives you right standing with the Father. And we have already received. I want us to engage deeper and get to seek more of it. Are there areas in your life that you feel you need to stand well in the Lord? Are there areas in your life that you feel they need to be corrected? Are there areas in your life that you feel they need to be straightened? Not necessarily see, because we have been given this righteousness. It could be a service. It could be an opinion. It could be an attitude. Because that is all that pertains to the kingdom. And once we have been able to receive all this, the word of the Lord is clear. The car we've been seeking after, the jobs we've been looking for, the families we have been looking for, everything that we have been seeking will be granted. Blessed be the name of Jesus Christ. I want you to lift up your voice. I want you to open up your mouth and ask the Lord. You want to understand more of him more of his righteousness this gift of righteousness you want to know you want to unveil you want to eat revealed in your life in the name of jesus i want you to pray in that regard hallelujah i want you to pray in that direction the kingdom of god establishment is not just to come by declaring and declaring there are some things that we need to do there are some things that need to be put right there are some things that need to be returned to the former place that they used to be there are some things that need to be mended that's why i'm asking you to ask the lord to help you to stay in the righteousness that he has given you to stay in understanding of the calling that he has given unto your life in the name of jesus somebody lift up your voice and tell the lord to help you that you'll be able to enjoy his righteousness that you'll be able to enjoy his righteousness he has given it unto us it is a gift to us then why are we not able to live a righteous life open up your mouth and tell the lord i want to understand more i want to know more I want to be found, King of all glory, in the right standing with you. There can never be guilt in my spirit when you have given me your righteousness. When there is an exchange that has taken place, the one who knew no sin has become sin on my behalf. Then I refuse to live in guilt. I refuse to live a life of torment. I refuse to live a life of pain. I refuse to live a life of bondage. Because Lord, you have done it for me. You have done it for me. And your peace and joy in the Holy Ghost is that which my heart desire. Your peace and joy in the Holy Ghost is that which my heart seeking after, Lord. Is that which my heart is seeking after. In the the joy of the kingdom somebody pray that it will override every place we will be pray that the joy of the kingdom will override every matter in your life that you never be in a place that is abs absence of joy you never be in a place that has absence of joy because when joy comes Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. The workings of the kingdom to become physical, to become a reality in our lives. The workings of the kingdom. The workings of the kingdom. 
the workings of the kingdom Lord to become a reality in our physical lives to become a manifestation in our lives in the name of Jesus Christ the power of the kingdom to back us in everything that we endeavor to do in our businesses now when we have sought and when we have prioritized the right Oh yes, the kingdom of God will back us in our lives. We will back us in our workings. We will back us in our jobs. We will back us in our families. Do you need to see the kingdom of the Lord established in your family? Do you need to see the kingdom of the Lord established in your business? Do you want to see the kingdom of God established in your ministry? Do you want to see the kingdom of the Lord established? Somebody lift up your voice and continue in prayer. Open up your mouth and continue seeking the Lord. He is found to them that seek Him. Oh, He is found to them that seek Him. Some mystic David said, I sought the Lord and He was found of me. I sought the Lord and He was found of me. Somebody, we are here to seek the kingdom. We are here to seek the Lord. When we say we are seeking the kingdom, we are simply saying we are seeking the kingdom owner. And when we seek him, he will be found of us. Somebody, we are guaranteed. We are guaranteed that he will be found. This is our testimony. This is our confidence. This is our confidence. This is our boldness. This is our encouragement. This is the courage that we carry. That whenever we seek after him, he is found. He is found. He is not a liar. He is not a liar. He is not a liar. He is not a man that he should lie. Nor is he a son of man to repent himself. He is a faithful God. He is a faithful God. I give you glory, my Father. You are a faithful God. You are a faithful God. We are here, Lord, to seek of your kingdom. Oh, let it be established in our lives. Let your kingdom be established in our families. Oh, your kingdom is righteousness, Lord. It is peace, dear Father. Everything that works with peace, dear Lord. There can never be peace in trials. There can never be peace in the storm. There can never be peace in pain. Dear Lord, oh my shakara bosokoteri bashande boyakatabo. Unless dear Father, it a be the peace that surpasses all understanding. There can never be peace in the storm unless it is the peace that surpasses all understanding. And that peace is the peace that is in your kingdom. And that peace, it is the peace that is in your kingdom. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. We give you praises. For today we are going home rejuvenated. For today we are going home. Dear Father, oh dear Lord, with our courts full of your peace. With our courts full of your peace, Lord. For you are healing our hearts. For you are healing our spirits. You are healing our minds, Lord. You are giving us comfort. Peace that surpasses all understanding, Lord. I worship you and I bless you. I give you praises. Help me to prioritize. Oh, redeem and seek your kingdom first. Because your one tells me you keep them in your perfect peace. Them that their minds are stayed on you. Them that their minds are stained on you. Lord, you keep them in your perfect peace. Father, I worship you. For peace is one of the things that are in your kingdom. Oh God, I give you praises. God, I give you glory. I give you honor for the joy in the Holy Ghost. For the joy of your kingdom. That joy. Oh, This joy, my brother, my sister. This joy is not joy out of the happenings. It is not joy out of the things that are happening in your life. And they are causing you to be happy. It is a joy that cannot be explained. It is a joy that cannot be explained. A joy that can only come from the kingdom of God. A joy 
that can only come from the Father. And when this joy comes, when this joy comes, healing takes place. When this joy comes, victory is guaranteed. When this joy comes, oh, everything in your life is calm and peaceful. I want to tell you, you can be joyous 24 hours a day. It is possible to be joyous 24 hours a day. It is possible to be joyous all 365 days a year. It is possible to be peaceful all the days of your life. If we are going to understand this, if we are going to understand what it entails, oh, he has to be in the kingdom of God. My brothers and sisters, it is possible to enjoy this joy because it is a portion in salvation. It is a portion of salvation and it has been given us. It has been given us. It has been given us. We just need to start it. We just need to start it up. It is in you, my brother. This joy, this peace. If you are born again like me, it is in you. It is in you. Don't say there is no peace. Don't say you don't have joy. It is in you. Allow the Spirit of God to start it up in you. Open up your mouth and start it up. Open up your mouth and start it up. Don't allow the wicked to rob you this. It is your portion. It is part of the kingdom. It is part of the kingdom. We thank you, our God. Oh, for our families. There will be joy at our homes. There will be joy in our places of work. There will be joy in our nation. There will be joy in our country. Things that come to rob us joy. Things that come to rob us your peace, dear master. Oh, Redeemer, we are overriding them. Oh, by this joy, by this peace uh, that cannot be explained by human words, that cannot be explained by human words, Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ. And we are declaring that we will stay on top. We will stay above only. We cannot go under where these things that drains us are. We cannot go under where pain is. We cannot go under where disappointment is. We cannot go under where there is no rest. For we are overriding. We are overriding every stranger in our lives in the name of Jesus. Of Christ, for we have become partakers of the kingdom of God. We have become partakers of the kingdom of God, and it has been established. It has been established in our lives. It has been established in our lives. My brothers and my sisters, we are the children of the kingdom because we have received the Father through the Son. Jesus Christ by salvation we just need to dig deeper we just need to venture deeper we just need to venture deeper and to prioritize well I will keep on repeating that and to prioritize well so that we can be able to have everything else ended we can have everything else included we can have everything else included in the equation. Oh yes, victory is guaranteed. Success is guaranteed. Healing is guaranteed. Overcoming is guaranteed. Only good life is guaranteed. Because we've got the kingdom. We've got the kingdom. We've got the kingdom. We've got the kingdom. Power is guaranteed. Because we've got the kingdom. Be encouraged, my brother, my sister. Be encouraged, somebody. You've got the kingdom. You may be not having anything else. You may lose everything else. But when the kingdom of God is in your life, when it is well established in your life, hey, everything else, everything else has no choice but to come along. I pray that you keep the kingdom. I pray that you keep the kingdom agenda. I pray that we keep the kingdom business. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ.
that we don't lose our place in the kingdom because when we have the kingdom we have the key we have the key we have the key to everything else in the name of Jesus Christ we thank you our master and we give you praises we give you glory we give you honor we thank you for the splendor of the kingdom that has become our covering we thank you our healer for the establishment of your royalty in our lives because kingdom is full of lawyers therefore we have become royalties for the kingdom of god is reigning in our lives the heavenly is with us my brothers and sisters christ has made us priesthood kings we have been made priesthood kings to our god how can we or reign in the kingdom when we are outside how can we carry priest duties when we are outside we need to be inside rightfully and well positioned and the good thing is it has been given to us it has been given to us we are the children of the kingdom we are the children of god we have become co-heirs with christ jesus Therefore, we can speak to any mountain in our lives. We can command any situation in our lives and yet we are told in the name of Jesus Christ because we have understood who we are in Christ. Who we are in Christ. I thank you, my Father. I bless you. I give you praises. I give you glory. I give you honor. I give you adoration. Thank you for loving me this much. Thank you for loving us this much. Somebody open up your mouth. Tell him thank you for loving you. Tell him thank you for loving you. Oh, what kind of a king is this? Who will prepare a kingdom? Give his only begotten son to die for you so that you can receive the righteousness to be able to stand in his place so that you can inherit his kingdom. He is giving the kingdom. He is giving a remedy. Of how you should become a partaker of the same kingdom. What kind of love is this? Lift up your voice and tell him Lord I love you. Let your kingdom be established. In KPC. Let your kingdom be established in KPC. Let your kingdom be established in Kirinyaga County. Let your kingdom be established in our nation. Oh God let there be no confusion. Let there be no stress. Let there be no depression. Oh God, for you are kingdom is reigning. Anything king of our glory that is speaking contra. That is speaking contrary Jesus. To that which you have ordained as our portion. Our father we refuse to take it. In the name of Jesus Christ. And we declare to the enemy. That we know who we are in Christ Jesus. We have become children of the Most High God. We are partakers. We are partakers of the inheritance that is in the kingdom. Sickness is not our portion. Oh yes, bitterness is not our portion. Anything that is not of God, we refuse to carry it anymore. In the name of Jesus Christ, when the kingdom of God is established, there is no more unforgiveness. When the kingdom of God is established, there is no more lack. When the kingdom of God is established, there are no more struggles. Oh, because now, oh, the reigning of the kingdom has become our dwelling place. And we are the kings. We are the kings reigning with the king, our God. Lift up your voice and tell the Lord, thank you. Lift up your voice and tell the Lord, I love you. Lift up your voice and tell the Lord, my heart is settled. Oh yes, open up your mouth, tell the Lord, Lord, my heart is settled. My heart is settled. I will not worry on what to eat or drink. I will not worry on what to wear. I will not worry on what will become of me tomorrow. Seeing that the bands of the air or oh, redeemer they do not plant they do not farm dear father you care for them oh redeemer you have their day
days with you seeing that the flowers of the field my father in your splendor you clothe them how much more is my life oh lord and the way i am precious to you and the way i am beloved to you and the way king of all glory you are concerned about me oh you didn't die for any animal you didn't die for any plant but lord you died for me what a precious thing to belong to you what a blessing to belong to you i am blessed of you i am so privileged of the lord i am so privileged of the lord i refuse to care i refuse to worry i'll cast all my burdens to the lord i'll cast all my burdens to the lord i refuse to carry when he has given me a shoulder to lean on. I refuse to carry. I refuse to carry. I refuse to carry in the name of Jesus Christ. For who by worrying, for who by worrying will add as teacher in his height? For who by worrying will add even a single hair in his hand? I refuse to worry. Worry! I refuse you in the name of Jesus I refuse to be depressed I can never be depressed I can never be depressed somebody open up your mouth and declare I can never be stressed I refuse that language in my tongue I refuse that language in my tongue I cannot be depressed I can never be stressed when I know how valued I am to my God when I know he has allowed me to share the kingdom with him. Oh, when I know what it entails to be a kingdom partaker. Oh, I only need to prioritize. I only need to prioritize. Somebody, you only need to put priorities right. Seek him first the kingdom. Seek him first the kingdom. Seek him first the kingdom and his righteousness and these other things, these other things, oh that good family, that good marriage, that good job, that good business, that good background, everything will be ended. Oh, I am so blessed. Open up your mouth and declare I am so blessed. Open up your mouth and declare, I am so blessed. Hey, in which report have I believed? Have believed in the report of my father. Hey, in which report, my brothers and sisters, have you believed? He is saying, cast your burdens unto me. He has said, I will never leave you none forsake you where is this voice coming from that you are forsaken you are forgotten arise and tell it back off to where you belong in the name of jesus the situations could be speaking so matters in your life could be confirming something that the enemy is whispering to you but i want to tell you you've got to stir up your joy you've got to stir up your peace for the kingdom of God is righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Ghost. You've got to stir it up. You've got to stir it up and tell the situations. You cannot rob the joy of the Holy Spirit from me. You cannot take away the peace of the Lord from me. Hey, I'm standing on a rock that can never be shaken. Therefore, I can never have feeble knees from where? I can never have loose hands from where? When I'm standing on a rock that can never be shaken. Oh, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, our God. We give you praises. We give you glory. We give you honor. We give you adoration. You are amazing. You are amazing. You are amazing. We worship you. We bless you, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord, I want to 
want to be in your kingdom. I want to have it established and working in me. Hallelujah. For your glory, Jesus. I will do anything just to see you, Lord. To behold you as my King. For your glory, I will do anything just to see you, Lord, to behold you as my King. I want to be where you are. I want to be where you are I wanna be where you are oh, I wanna be where you are somebody lift up your voice tell him for your glory I will do anything just to see your kingdom established in my life give the Lord a celebration in the house give him a clap of give him a clap of Somebody give him a clap of fire. Somebody give him a clap of fire. Somebody celebrate Jesus. Somebody celebrate Jesus. Give him praises. Give him praises. Give him praises. For your glory, Jesus. We thank you. We worship you. We adore you. We honor you. Let us all lift up our hands to the Lord. Even as we come to the conclusion of our prayers, we thank the Lord for them that have joined us from our platforms. May the Lord bless you and do you good. Even as we come to the conclusion, a great blessing you've been. And we declare in the name of Jesus Christ that which we are sharing as our package and as our portion from, the, from our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, we declare the same comes to you for having kept time to be together with us. We thank the Lord for you in the name of Jesus. Church, let's release them that are watching from our platforms.